So God is doing the blessing, and he's continually doing the blessing, and now to whom? The poor in spirit. When I was younger and I first read this, I didn't quite get it. How could you be poor in spirit? I always thought of poor being financially or not having a home or of material things, but not anything spiritual. But in the, the real meaning of this, to be poor in spirit means to be, be destitute. We 
so blessed, if you want to talk about blessings, we've been so blessed here in America to be pretty much free of oppression religiously for the past 250 years. We take it for granted. You know, we all hide in our churches and our pews and think, you know, if someone wants to hear, they'll just come and everything will be fine. And yet, it minimizes the mission of the church. That's a whole other subject. Also, turn with me to Proverbs chapter 16, verse 19. And who would like to read that? Proverbs 16, verse 19.